Emmerdale star Mark Charnick spoke to Express.co.uk about King Charles' special tribute to the soap. Mark Charnick, who is best known for playing Marlon Dingle in ITV show Emmerdale, explained how he felt following King Charles's tribute to the soap for its 50th anniversary. Mark admitted that it was surreal when the king appeared on the massive screen in front of him at the National Television Awards last week. Mark recalled his excitement on the night that Emmerdale won Best Serial Drama at the NTA's 2022. I went on to recall how things became truly surreal when the king himself wished the cast a happy anniversary as the show celebrated 50 years of being on the airwaves. It was also a big night for Mark, who was thrilled, to win Best Serial Drama Performance. The star was competing against co-star Paige Sandhu, who plays Mina Hootla on the show. As well as EastEnders stars Gillian Wright and Rose Ailing Ellis. Mark also won big at the Soap Awards last night, walking away with the prizes for Best Actor, Best Storyline and Best Romance. Speaking to Express.co.uk at the event, Mark recalled the incredible moment he saw King Charles appear in a touching tribute last week. He said, Joel Domit was standing next to me and I was letting myself get ready for a comedian like Harry Enfield or something like that. And I had this dawning realization and it was, oh, that's not a deep fake. It was, surreal, and it was great, but it was surreal, he reflected. Last week, the king appeared via video link during the Glamorous Awards show, which aired live from the OVO Arena in Wembley. Starting with a joke, he said, I am afraid I am so old I remember when it was called Emmerdale Farm, owned by the Sugdens. The king then went on to praise the long-running soap, stating, It is a testament to all the hard work of its production team that it has since become such an important British institution and a major British export with hundreds of thousands of fans from Scandinavia to New Zealand, all keen to follow the fortunes of what is left of the Sugdens and their new neighbours.